Hi guys, this is Rice Snow. This is another quick extra video and I will introduce two debug functions that are useful when you create your own map. And both are pretty simple and maybe some of you guys are already doing something similar. But anyway, let's start. The first one is showing the character's current position on the screen. We've created this debug function check draw time before so when you press T key then uh, you can show some uh, debug text on the screen and so we're gonna add a little more here and uh, also I think I'm gonna change this name to uh, not check draw time but show debug text or something so it represents its function more precisely change this real quick and here too so we're gonna display players world x world y and call and allow so type like this okay let's set font set font i'm gonna use area plane like 20 or something first x and uh, y and x will be like 10 and y is 400 so i'm gonna place this x and y instead also line height line height like 20 and okay here draw string draw string first world y, uh, world x world x is player dot world x and also world y world y and call and allow so call Low. Oops. Uh, okay, so call is so make sure to you add players solid area x uh, x and uh, divide it by tile size so we can get the position precisely. World Y plus player dot solid area dot Y and divide it by tile size. Yeah, that's it, I think. Oh, okay. And uh, after that, so after drawing each text, we increase this Y by line height. Okay, let's check. So press T key. Yeah. So now we can see player's position like this. So this is especially useful when you want to know a certain tile on objects call and allow. For example, if I decided to place a key here on this tile then uh, you need to know it's call and allow but uh, you know searching its position on this text map is often takes time but if you have this function then uh, this is call 25 and low 19 so yeah let me do this real quick so 25 19 run the game yeah like this okay and the next function is how to instantly apply the change on the map file 
So we are creating our world map with this text file and uh, usually when you edit this map you need to restart the game to see the change but actually you can implement a function to apply the change on the spot. So okay inside of this key handler we add uh, kind of a shortcut key I'm gonna use any key is fine but R key refresh and when you press this key we just need to call gp.tilem.loadmap and okay pass the uh, file pass so okay so let's pass this map file pass from here as well yeah it starts the game and uh, for example like in my case 3 is 41 so maybe I want to place 3 somewhere around here like this and uh, press ctrl s or the save the map and press r key then so you can instantly apply the change and check how it looks like. So yeah, creating debug functions often make your development easier and sometimes a simple trick like this makes a pretty big difference. So maybe you can also come up with some convenient functions. I hope this was useful. Thanks for watching and uh, until next time.